In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with you all. And with your spirit. As we gather to be present to the sacrifice of Jesus Christ under the appearance of bread and wine. A sacrifice acceptable by our loving Father in atonement for our sins. So let us humbly acknowledge our need for this because we are sinners. We need forgiveness. I confess, confess Almighty God, God and to you, my brothers and sisters, that, that I have greatly sinned sin. in, in my thoughts and in my words and what I have done and what I have failed to do, through my fault, through my fault, through my mind's fault. Therefore I ask that as many as have heard of it, all the saints, and you, my brother and sister, to pray for me to the Lord our God. May Almighty God have mercy upon us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to life everlasting. Amen. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Christ have mercy, Christ have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Lord have mercy. Almighty, ever living God, let us feel your compassion more readily during these days when, by your gift, we have known it more fully, so that those you have freed from the darkness of error may cling more firmly to the teachings of your truth through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen.
until we reach Caesarea. The word of the Lord. Amen. Someone 
to explain them to us. Like Philip did to the Jews, right? And he explained it so well that he got converted in those very few moments. In those very few moments. It could have been an hour, 30 minutes, 15 minutes. But he got converted. Because he understood the word of God. Understand the word of God. Understand it. And that's how we enter into salvation. And then, of course, the church is here as, you know, oh, you know, agrees to be you know, in the minister's sacrament. And you're supposed to keep me from being baptized. Stop the sharing, got out, go fill the blood in the water, and he baptized him. And he received in that baptism what, what he understood in the scriptures. Eternal life. Eternal life. It was all done by the power of the Holy Spirit. As soon as that is done, the Holy Spirit takes Philip and he doesn't see him anymore. Oh, that is the work of the church. How many people have you talked to about God and witness? They're not here anymore. Sometimes they're here and they remember that. Said, oh, yes, I remember I talked to someone. A prisoner? Is a divorced person? Someone that had an abortion? Someone that killed someone?
of the Rural Collaborative Foundation to great people. No, I think they are. And now you may voice your intention for the ones in the side of the board. We pray to the Lord. We thank you, Father, for the privilege to seek help in every need as we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. And blessed are you, Lord God, of all creation. Through your goodness, we have this bread to offer which earth has given. Human hands has made. It will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever. And blessed are you, Lord God, of all creation. Through your goodness, we have this wine to offer. Fruit of the vine, work of human hands. It will become for us our spiritual drink. Let it be God forever. Lord God, we ask you to receive us. Be pleased with the sacrifice that we offer you with humble and soft of heart. Lord, portion of your mind to the truth. Then in the Holy Spirit. Pray, brothers and sisters, that my sacrifice and yours will be acceptable to God, the Father. Almighty. May the Lord accept the sacrifice of the times for the praise and glory of his name, for our good and the good of all of his holy church. O oh God, who by the wonderful exchange effected in this sacrifice have made us partners and partakers of the one supreme Godhead, grant we pray that we, that as we have come to know your truth, we may make it our way by a worthy way of life through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. Lift up your heart. Let, the mother be with you. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is, it is truly right and just and our duty and salvation always and everywhere to give you thanks through your beloved Son, Jesus Christ our Lord. He is the word who you have made the universe and, and, and our Redeemer, incarnate of the Holy Spirit and born of the Virgin Mary, and fulfilling your will and gaining for you a holy people, he stretched out his hands as he endured the passion so as to bring and break the bonds of death and and manifest the resurrection. So with all the angels and saints, we proclaim your glory as we say, Holy, 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 Holy Lord, Lord, God of hosts, heaven and earth, and earth, and earth, and earth, and earth Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the Father, of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, we pray, by sending down your gift upon these, <clears throat> upon these like a new fall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed, yeah. he took bread, said the blessing, broke the bread, gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when 
the supper was ended, and he took the chalice. Once more, giving thanks, gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many, for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. We proclaim your death, O Lord, and profess your resurrection until you come down. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the, <coughs> the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, and giving thanks that you have found us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that, partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Lord, remember your church spread throughout the world, bring it to the fullness of charity. Together with Francis, our Pope, and Michael, our Bishop, and all the clergy, remember also your servant, Matthew, who took call from his life to yourself. Grant that she who was united to your Son and the like death may also be one with him in his resurrection. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of resurrection, all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, the Mother of God, Blessed Joseph, her spouse, the Blessed Apostle, all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, may we merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him, with him, in him, O God Almighty, Father, in unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Jesus taught his first friends to call God friends. So we have the courage to say together the prayer that Jesus taught his first brothers and sisters of faith. Our Father, Our Father who art in heaven, heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy, thy kingdom come, come thy will be done, done on earth as it is in heaven. Give, give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as, as we give you those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, O Lord, from every evil, and graciously grant us peace in our days in your mercy. Keep us free from sin, safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, kingdom and the power and the glory are yours, now, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, you said to your apostles, I leave you peace, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. And the peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit, let us offer each other the sign of peace. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Grant us peace. Behold. The Lamb of God. Behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are 
those who are called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I'm not worthy that you should enter under my roof. Speak but of these same words, and my soul shall be healed. spiritual communion and prayer. My Jesus, I believe that you are present in the most holy sacrament. I love you above all things and desire to receive you into my soul. Since I cannot at this moment receive you sacramentally, come at least spiritually into my heart. I embrace you as if you were already there and unite myself wholly to you. Never permit me to be separated from you. Let us pray. Graciously be present to your people, we pray, O Lord, and lead those that you have imbued and with heavenly mysteries to pass from former ways to newness of life through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. With your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, Father. Son, the Holy Spirit. Amen. Let us all go in peace to love and to serve the Lord. Amen.